Hi friends, in this video I am trying to explain the things related to the uh, importing of OGL data uh, in various methods. Uh, I am aware about uh, two to three methods. I will explain those things in this video. Okay, uh, and then after importing, you can creating a ground surface. Okay, that also I will try to cover in this video. Okay, these these are very useful. Okay, because after all the horizontal alignment, you need to create the uh, ground surface. Then only you can proceed to the vertical profile. Okay, so before that, I am just uh, I just want to uh, give us some brief idea about this uh, few things in MX. See, this is the things model display. I already I think most of them are uh, aware about. For for those who are not aware, I'm just trying to explain this thing. And then this this is model over the display. So already one model is there. You want to display another model. So just click. Yes. See. Okay. And then suppose if you want to remove this model, you want to keep only this one. So just click erase. Okay. And then this also you can erase it. Okay this is very simple okay and then this uh, everyone aware about this simple xref attach reference and then this is level display okay all are micro session tools okay then i'm just uh, st start to with the ascii file ascii file is nothing but it's, uh, it's, a, it's a type of format uh, uh, for importing the data so if you have excel data suppose uh, surveyor have given this uh, xyz details in excel format okay instead of cad so that all that is a very quick process uh, you can import it very easily that i will show first here import option is there ascii import just give new format here this one ascii file Case three, and okay. CSV. It must be CSV format. Okay. Then next, see here. Okay. Character delimited. Next, comma. Next. After that, uh, wait. It's loading. Actually. Hmm. Now just simply easting and then select our thing and then level that's it next next yes you just give some name p3 tutorial that's it and then these are all points so you just select the point feature string sorry find features and gives some string name p o 0 0 okay and then simply next e yes actually it says override the existing file yes simply yeah. before this tutorial i tried myself that's why it is showing okay 70 percent it's completed yes now you just click ok right just simply click ok 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 just less than half minute it will get completed done so now model get created so just display that Hmm. I'm just giving a new 
this here okay and then simply click on all that can see the points okay string name pivo 0 0 and then point is written okay so that's it it's very simple okay uh, importing the OGL through ASCII file now oh, I'm going to do the things in uh, what to say the basic format uh, okay that is nothing but file CAD menu just go to here import CAD file sorry data and here hmm, done so now next menu you just this uh, erase this display this one points now I am ex uh, importing these uh, lines erase your lines that is through basic method CAD menu method and then import the CAD file okay automatically it will come in the interface but it won't go into the MX main interface like model and string now model and strings are not created with respect to these lines so that that way I am going to do in a few minutes okay before that I just want to explain I just want to give some small suggestion okay so if you create the MX project automatically this one two these this these four folders will get created okay so instead of that you just try to create a, uh, few folders which will be very useful uh, for uh, data management so I am just created data in this thing you can create uh, whatever the uh, data you are getting from the surveyor or, or excel sheets or all, this, or, or all these things and then input uh, for line mode you can create this folder okay and then to give the CAD person you can create this output folder okay this these three folders are enough I think um, based on your convenience you can create more folders okay now let's go to that main thing okay see this is very important level display you can click here all up see it will go now see here see here carriage edge line pivot shoulder line napping shoulder line so now I don't want all on I, I don't want this point feature and then this level okay so you just create a model here OGL lines okay click here yes detail survey style set I am giving okay now these are all carriage your channel not all some wait up and shoulder pivot shoulder pivot shoulder so remind selection this 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 okay these are all carriage re related just simply click again yes okay it's gone now model get created and then just simply erase this model so here so this also carriage line so simply select again Okay, 
this also we can erase it now this two lines are there this four lines you can select it earth lines simply yes that's it so now we can display the entire model that's it so model came in these lines came into the model interface okay model and strings also created see this eg01 the programs this is ewrk and then co okay carriage lines okay so after this you have this uh, points data also just display over this model hmm. so now you got the idea so we have everything lines we have and then points also have okay now just go here just simply make land display try it okay now what i'm doing i'm just copying the strings from points data to the ogl lines po00 apply it's loading done okay now you can delete the model points data package 3 yes now you can display the OGL lines everything came now I am doing the main part creating a ground surface that is triangulation triangulation from a string model I just select the model OGL lines and then model to store triangulation you have to give the name of the surface DTM DM. Digital, yes and then you select triangulation existing boundary there is no boundary trimming details you just trim trim to string that's it yes that's it done you see surface has been created this you can use for the design of vertical profile mm. and then other method that other method you will get in the next video okay I hope you enjoyed this video please practice this these two methods okay one is ASCII method and then the simple CAD menu method okay you just separate the lines and uh, just import it and give some model name and then just simply select here the features okay then automatically it will come into the string interface that's it guys thanks for watching okay